here's a what our family vlog for this Monday and um, I know we had a, we had a nice Christmas everything went really fine with that except for I don't know something mysteriously appeared by the window on the windowsill mm -hmm. and some weird stuff happened yeah out. yeah we gotta send it back to Canada Is that really his? I recognize it look look at that he left it here. Oh. We gotta get it. We gotta get it somehow back to him. How? Oh. He's probably what? been looking for. It. He's probably going crazy trying to find it. And here it is. Where'd you find it, Caitlin? I found it. Where'd you find it? In the laundry it? room. In the what? My gosh. <laughs> you probably can find anything in that room. Wait. We gotta put that aside because we gotta we gotta give it back to, to we gotta bring it back. Can we give it back to Jules? I don't know. Are we gonna just mail it or something? Can we mail it there? Can I call Canada. Yeah, call my. You gotta tell him we got it. Wow, Caitlin okay, found this like. Brianna found what, it. This, uh, yeah, her family yeah, hoodie. Found it. <laughs> Here, put it on the door. I found the hoodie. Put it right there. Put it right there. Just put it right there. I'm gonna call. You know, they were trying to find Caitlin something to wear, and then you, you found something. That's crazy. All right, well, we gotta get out of here. Uh, we still gotta find your jacket. Uh, I don't know where it is. So that's where she's gonna do that thing. Huh? Did you I find? Where it? Uh, Leave. We're gonna. We gotta. Sit, we gotta mail it to him. I know. I did try. You're not gonna mail yourself to him. She probably would. <laughs> you can't go in the in the box with it. So wasn't it amazing, like looking at Caitlin's expressions, like? No. I'm just kidding. I mean, like her expressions, like for whole, all, all the Christmas presents and just like us being together and just like her experiencing the magic. She was of like, <laughs> she got so excited. No, that was amazing. She really enjoyed that. She's a cutie. She's, she's got a play date now, playing with her best bestie, best friend. I don't have a play date. I don't have my bestie here. And then her little friend's coming here. She's probably going to do a slumber party. And they want to they watch movies downstairs. <laughs> they want to watch the uh -uh. big screen. I have to finish watching Stranger Things for the second time. Before sure they you want to keep watching that stuff with all this yes, cause stuff Stranger you guys have been doing lately? Yes, because Stranger Things is bomb. Like, yeah. I love Stranger Things. Yeah. I will watch. That's like one of those shows that, like, that's a show that can never get old. Like, you can just watch it and keep watching it, and it's like not gonna get boring. Yeah. Yeah, you watched mm -hmm. it. I know. It's good. Especially downstairs, you feel it. I know. It's like <laughs> boom, boom. How's this stuff, huh? Spinach. Good. I made this pumpkin pudding. If you like pumpkin pie, it's like pumpkin pie filling. How do you make that? With Pumpkin and spices and eggs and stevia, some agave nectar, some coconut sugar. So it's like pumpkin pie filling without the all the salt and all that sugar because I'm using different kind of stuff to sweeten it. Yeah, instead of like the cane sugar, I'm using, you know, the coconut sugar and what else? Agave nectar, right Brianna? It still tastes gross in tea. What tastes gross? Oh God, I put it in, in my tea? tea and it tasted gross. Huh. Yeah. I never finished drinking it. Well, hmm. It was like a week ago. So we got stuff to clean up. We got all the presents. Caitlin's got, look at all the presents. Caitlin's got so many presents over there. She's got a whole bunch. She's got like, you know, everything she ever wanted, really. It's amazing how she got all that stuff. My stomach is hurting. That's good, huh? I am full. Oh, no. Did you just hear that? It's not like the freaking... All right, it's not like... Rihanna, it's not like the freaking window just, like, shut over here, but we're right here. How can the window... The windows have been shut, so how can the... It's not like the window... Brianna, yeah. come here. You need to see something right here. Right by the friggin' window. Right here, look. Is that is that the pen from your Ouija board thing, whatever you, when you're doing Charlie Charlie or something like that? Whatever the friggin' thing you were doing? Isn't the pen that I threw out? What the freak is it doing there? Huh? Whoa, there. Go, 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 go! I don't know, that was, that, that
your freaking window just open. We have to shut this deep door. You just saw that, right? Is it that wasn't me, right? You just saw that. I'm not like imagining anything, right? The freaking window just Ooh. freaking opened. Are you freaking serious? Hold this. I don't know. You sure you want to go over there? I don't know. Should we just? No, no. How would the freaking window freaking open like that? Let's just stay, stay down here for a minute. We gotta think this one. We gotta think that. How did the freaking pen get there? Did you put it there? No, I didn't put it there. You didn't put it there. I was eating food in the kitchen. Kaden got it done because she has a play date with a friend. Pretends at work. Do we grab the pen and burn it? What do we do with it? I don't know. But when you when you got rid of the, the other ones, did you throw it? Did you just throw it out? You said you threw it outside. Did you do anything to it before you threw it outside? Did you break it or anything? The pencils, I broke them and then I threw them. What about the pens? Because you guys are using pens too. You said you were getting rid of those. Yeah, but I destroyed them. I broke them and I threw them. I threw them like way out in the freaking. You broke pens? Yeah. What was that? What was that? I don't know. Someone's walking. I just heard someone walking. I know. It. I hear something too. Nobody's even here. Brittany's working. Caitlin's on a play date. What a freak. Is it coming from upstairs? In your room? It's not there. Bet you I have food on my mouth. We need to get rid of that pen. We need to get the pen out of here. I'm not touching that. It's right there. We need to get rid of it, Brianna. How does it freaking how do, how does it freaking open by itself like that? Any idea? Huh? You don't, no, like wind's not gonna do that. There's no way that wind would do that, right? You know what I mean? And if somebody was outside, like, trying to play a joke on us, I would assume the screen wouldn't be here. And somebody would be out, how would they even do it? I, if you were to saw something, you would have seen, like, a hand or something, right? Wouldn't you think you'd see something if somebody was, like, messing with us? Yeah. I mean, we got... And we got people that like came in here because we did clown videos and they were stalking us, doing weird stuff. You think you don't think somebody would like just kind of do something with the window and try to freak us out? I don't know. Because they watch your videos and they watch these paranormal things and they, they think they're going to just prank us with this? Because how would the window just like do that? You get what I'm saying? How does it freaking like go by itself? I don't, I don't, you know, I, I didn't see any like anything except for the freaking window opening. So if somebody came over here messing with it, how would they how would they do it without us seeing them? I don't get it. It's like it's just a freaking window. It's not a power window either. It's like a regular window. <sighs> and these things are in a lock position. I don't know. I don't know if somebody's just being being funny about this, playing a prank on us, or you playing with that stupid whatever that freaking trolley trolley game is causing this kind of stuff to happen. Because how do you explain the Christmas tree moving? How do you explain that stuff upstairs in the attic? And now you know this happening. Did you touch the tree? I didn't touch the tree. Why? That ball's moving. The ornament's moving. Really? Did you stop that? Oh. You just started moving. That is weird. I don't know, Brianna. That part of the tree started moving. Where? I... 
You know what, this, this stuff is just getting like, I don't know Brianna, this is getting kind of weird. We never said goodbye to Charlie. You never said, well what is that supposed to, if you don't say goodbye, what does that mean? You're supposed to say goodbye. Anytime you communicate with the dead or communicate with spirits, you just say goodbye. Did you, whoa, did you just see that? Brianna, the, the friggin' lights just flickered on that tree. Right here. Both times we never said goodbye. Two times. Well, right, Brianna, right here, the yellow one, that just started flickering. That one right there. Are you serious? Right, see that one right there? Mm -hmm. It started flickering. Just a second ago, it just, it just flickered. <laughs> Are you freaking, Brianna, Brianna. Just. All right, how did that freaking chair just move by itself, Brianna? How did the freaking thing just freaking move? There's, no, there's nobody in, even in that freaking area. There's nobody even there, Brianna. Okay, so how does a chair move? How does a window move? Why are you so like freaking like this about it? This is probably some stupid ghost. Why are you so like mad about it? It's just, it's like something. Because I get out. stressed. I get stressed. All right, because I don't like, I don't like this kind of stuff going on. And you know what? Because you guys mess with all that freaking voodoo, whatever the heck it is. It's fun. Fun. It's so this game. is this is fun right now. It's just a game. Just a game? All right, so then how's the chair and all that stuff? How's all this weird stuff, tree moving, windows going up and down, chair flying, things flying at the, up in the attic? How does it all become a game? Where's the game part of that, Brianna? I don't know. You don't know, because I know a game is a game, but when this stuff happens, that's, to that's like, that is not a game no more. This is not a freaking game, but I don't, you know, I, why do they even sell that stuff in a store and call it a game? And why we go online, Charlie, Charlie, it's a pencil game, okay? If it's a game, then why is this kind of stuff happening in this house? This is a new house. We don't have, we shouldn't have anything here. There should not be anything in this house that's gonna be causing this. So how is this even happening? Is it, do you, you I seem to know more about this than I do. How you're am I supposed to know? I know about the stuff. I know about what you're supposed to do and what you're not supposed to do with the Ouija board. If you and did, Charlie, Charlie why, why is this happening if you did? What is it that you, you know? And what do you not know? That's what I'm trying to figure out, Brianna. What is it that you, there's something obviously that you're, you're overlooking because this stuff is happening. Is it, do you want this stuff to happen? Yeah, of course, I want this to happen. You do? Of course. Sarcasm, sarcasm, sarcasm. I'm just, I'm stressed, Brianna. I, I'm done with all this drama. But, I mean, all the clown videos we put out there. Look at the stalkers we ended up having because of that. And then we, now we do paranormal videos. What is it? Somebody messing with us? Somebody pulling a prank? How the heck is someone gonna do that? I don't know because I try to. I try to reason, Brianna. I try to come up with a, like a logical explanation because this kind of stuff. When you don't see something like a chair moves, okay. So you see a person move a chair, okay. Or if somebody's pulling a prank, you think maybe they have a rope tied to it. But when I see a chair here, I don't see nothing tied to no chair. Nothing, just a chair sitting there, okay? Nothing there. I don't see nothing Nothing on the window. No, nobody's got like a piece of wood or something and I'm prying a window open. Maybe, I don't... Maybe it's someone in the upside down. What do you mean upside down? What is so funny about this? Stranger Things, the upside down. Well, why are we say, watch it. What does movies have to do with what's going on here? No, I was just trying to be funny. I'm sorry I'm not like laughing and stuff, Brianna, but I mean, this is like supposed to be our home. Yeah. This is Caitlin's stuff. Now look, it's, how did it get on the floor? Did I, did I just, <sighs> Sometimes you can't hide from the unseen because they always end up taking over. What I don't understand is what you're not even playing, really Brianna, you didn't even do any, like, Charlie, Charlie, we, did you or did you not? You didn't mess with that stuff today, did you? No. Because this stuff happened and you weren't, I, I didn't see you out with any of this stuff and this stuff is happening. A pen appears out of nowhere. It's not like a window slamming and I come in here and find a pen on a windowsill. That freaks me out because I know, I remember that pen. It's, I, I destroyed the pens and I burnt the thing in the, the grill. That's what I don't understand is why that's so bad. I don't so know bad. what's going on. 
Cause I, you know, a part of me thinks, oh, Brianna's prank is pulling a prank on me, but there's, a, oh. like, there's no way you can. I don't see how you can. That's in reality of that is like, how would she even like do that? What she got telekinesis? Is that what they call it? Is that what they call it? When mind power, where you can move things with your mind? What is it? Telekinetic, whatever. I don't know. Well, you don't have that. What the freak is that noise? Yeah, just, just hold on a second. If someone's up there, they better say something. I hear something. Do you hear that? Listen. It's wet up here. I'm not. I'm not pulling any pranks on you, and you're not pulling any pranks on me, right? No. Then who does? Who's freaking upstairs? I don't know. There's like no sign of anybody out there. I don't want to go back to in our house. Mm -hmm. What if what if the cat's in the house? What if that would maybe the cat's in the house, Brianna? Because maybe there's windows open somewhere else in here. Where else were you doing that Ouija board, whatever that freaking Charlie Charlie thing? Maybe there's a cat in here. Else. Sometimes I feel like having a camera makes it come but but I don't know. Do I want to, to have something come out? No. With the, if I'm walking around with the camera, I'm, I mean, am I asking for trouble or do I just put the camera down and we just hope for the best? Do I bring the camera with me and leave it on? I don't know. You're asking the wrong girl. Let's just, let's just look around. I think what we need to just do is look in the attic no, upstairs. Okay. No, I'm not going in there. I took a shower. I gotta get my shoes on because there's broken glass in there. I'm not going in there. Oh, that's right. I think I'm gonna move stuff in my room. It's got, we'll just check in there. We're gonna have to move stuff to get in there though. Really? Yes. Because it sounds like it's coming from that area. You said something about you wanted to get a Ouija board to see if you can get rid of this thing. Is that impossible or is it, are you just? I'm, I'm hoping it'll work. Hopeful. I'm hopeful. Because you know what? I'm gonna put my trust in you. Yeah, but then like if it doesn't go right, we might bring like demons in here. Oh, come on. Can we try it like maybe just maybe at the other house, the old house? I've played the Ouija board here before with Maddie. When was this? The back deck, and then there was some weird cross that showed up on the deck or some crap. Well, you want to do this stuff outside? I guess. What if you do it under the attic, where the table is right here, you know, right over there, where, where the, under the attic is? Just do it all over there, so it's not in the house. So maybe whatever is in the house, maybe you can draw it outside? Like, what, maybe, because it's in the attic? Possibly. Or something on our property. Draw it down from the attic. It'll follow you around. It can attach itself to you. You don't even know. We could have had stuff attach itself to us from the other house, and we don't even know. Because they can attach themselves. If you're not emotionally stable, they can attach themselves to you, and they draw for your energy. And you know, since July, I've, I've kind of been stressed out emotionally. Oh my god. You probably brought something here. Me, but I wasn't thinking about... Did you have to think about that kind of stuff? Because I wasn't thinking about paranormal stuff. I was thinking about my health and thinking about like... You don't have to think about it. It could just attach itself to you. Yeah, so it, just like Brianna loves those headphones. Looks we like love I love these. You what? guys, you are amazing. You guys are awesome. <laughs> yes. Amazing -er than these headphones. <laughs> Absolutely. Yes, you guys, you know... A very unique in your own special way and Everyone's we appreciate very unique. yes and we appreciate each and every one of you I hear and you hear something i hear ringing ringing your ears are, her ears are ringing probably from blasting music too much but anyway thank you guys for being there for us watching our videos subscribing and we have so much things we want to share with you and we're going to continue to share parts of our lives with you and um i know we don't always have positive things going on but that's the reality of life not everything is going to be positive right and we're just going to share with you everything that goes on here i know you're not gonna have the cameras on 24 7 but when we do have the cameras on and we're going to make sure that we share a moment with you 
And sometimes we don't always put everything on YouTube, right? We'll have cameras on, we'll have stuff from family memories that we keep for ourselves. Mm -hmm. But um, we do share a lot of what we do on YouTube, so you guys could see a lot of what's going on. And hopefully we can get past all this, I don't know, with this stuff you're doing, Brianna, it's kind of freaked me out, this spooky paranormal stuff. I mean, I, I this, the whole stalker mean. thing, the whole stalker thing is like a different kind of like, I don't know, thing. But this paranormal thing is like, I don't know, I feel like you can't walk away from it sometimes because it's like, you feel like it's just there no matter what. And, and sometimes it just lets you know it's there and sometimes it doesn't. I don't know. So I'm kind of, a part of me's kind of got mixed. I just, I don't know, I still have kind of mixed feelings about the whole thing. I really do. You can call me crazy all you want, but after a relative died, I had an encounter with them. Mm. And I swear, my hands up, I know my life could cough, it doesn't count. I swear I was in my room, and I don't even know if I've said this before, but I was in my room. I was like nine, I think. Maybe, I don't know. It was, Caitlin was like three months old. And I was like, I guess nine, or I was ten. I was either nine or ten. And just in my room, crying my eyes out because I was really close with them. I'm just crying because, you know, it's what happens. You cry after something like that. Yeah. I mean, I still cry sometimes, but, like, I cried a lot. And I was crying in my room, and I was just, like, praying and hoping that she'd come back. And, well, I know that wasn't going to happen because we already had, like, a funeral and everything. And it was depressing. It's a sad time. And I'm in my room, and I'm just in my bed. And I'm talking. And I'm just... She's, I know she wasn't in my room, but like I was just talking, hoping that she could hear me, and I was just talking to her, and like when you're encountered with a spirit, like you get chills and you can hear, feel the hairs raise on your body and it'll get cold, and I swear she was in my room and I swear she said everything is going to be okay and I swear she touched my arm. I swear, like, I can feel something on me. I can feel, like, the coldness. And, like, for some reason, I got relieved for a second. And I just heard someone whisper, everything was going to be okay. And I literally freaked out. And I don't know if you remember, but I ran into the um, room. You know, like, that huge blue room we had? And you yeah. would work in there, and you had your desk in there. Yeah. And my dollhouse in there. I remember, I don't know if you remember, but I ran in there, and I told you about it. Mm. Do you remember that or no? Yes, I remember that. I guess we're going to check back when... Well, I have more. More what? Pretty sure. Okay, oh. hold on. Let me think. Okay, I got those out of the way. Okay, so there's just one time. Okay. It was me, Gabby, and a bunch of her friends, and like, I guess what my friends do, they were really cool. And we were all having like sleepover, and we were, I think we played with the Ouija board, which was stupid. But we all heard like noises in the house, and I think someone left something in the basement, and we all went down the steps. Hmm. Like we all went down in the basement together because we were all scared. Yeah. So we all went down the steps and this one girl went ahead of everybody and she screamed. Like she went ahead of us and she like, tur like she turned off the steps and we were still coming down the steps and she screamed and ran up the steps and we started freaking out and we ran up the steps and she was like, I just saw these green eyes. And I was like, oh my God. what? That was scary. And then I'm trying to think. You know what I think about the whole Charlie thing? I don't. I just. I just think it's just. A, I don't know. I. I think it's just a stupid game, and I, I just it aggravates me that you know you guys like bring that kind of crap in the house. Okay. No. 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 You were a part of the first one. You I know, but after that stuff happened, that it's like. I can't even. You know. I don't know. I just. I just got mixed feelings about this stuff anyway, because I. You know. I, I just don't know what to think about it. Did you? Did you just hear that? Did the freaking tree just move? I could swear that freaking tree just moved. The freaking tree. Yeah. All right, I'm just going to see what in the freak. Why would this like move, Brianna? Man, it's like the whole freaking tree moved, like... It moved a couple of feet, Brianna.
It it definitely moved. There's no no doubt about it. It's it's it had moved. What I don't get is we're not playing any of these games. We're not you're not playing Charlie Charlie. You're not doing the Ouija stuff. Never, actually, never mind. I think that when you rip the paper, you say goodbye. I don't know. Maybe you brought something into this house. I don't, I don't mess with the spirits that yeah, are. You can. Maybe maybe you do. can the president have fallen off? Like it was stacked up and fallen. Oh yeah, the president just. I don't know. Free, Did, you know. I don't know. I'm just trying to figure out a logical. I don't. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna go look at the footage because I, I. It was in the background. Because I was zane that way. I'm gonna see. I don't know. The tree, it looked like a tree moved though. It, it, it looked like it was further away from the window than it was before. 